Today on Toy Shiz, be the necro, taste the necro. Let's talk toys. Welcome back, everyone. Toy Shiz here, and I am back yet again to give you guys another fresh look, courtesy of my friends over at McFarland Toys. And today, we are totally taste testing their brand new Blueberry Spawn, or rather yet... Mortal Kombat 11 spawn, the blue kind, or just the Lord Covenant spawn, right? And we'll talk about that in just a second. But really nice packaging, and overall, being that this is a skin for the Mortal Kombat 11 video game, I really don't mind them doing this, as long as it gets more spawn figures on the shelf, which, yeah, later this year, this fall, we will be getting a new line of of spawn action figures so being that it's based off something that comes from the video game it does work for me here's the barcode as well and like i said here's the spawn lord covenant at the top lord covenant looks like this <laughs> and towards the tail end of the original spawn line yes there was a lord covenant action figure the black knight sir ian covenant whatever you want to call him not really the black knight as some of these first type figures and he's not medieval spawn although he is in the medieval spawn sort of world because this is sir john right of york but like i said this is purely just a recolored skin i don't know why they call it lord covenant it's probably the mortal kombat 11 warner brothers games going let's give him a good name something to that degree but yeah this this in actuality is lord covenant very cool figure too one that i would like to get i know i hear the booze and everything that's a figure i don't actually have so this is gonna be fun sit back relax grab yourself a nice hot medieval cup of coffee this is a look at the brand new blueberry spawn lord covenant spawn mk11 repaint spawn by mcfarland toys and here's lord covenant all out of the packaging and First and foremost, I'll tell you this, as many times as we've gotten this body mold, the yellow spawn was okay. I did like it, but I really like the colors on this one a whole heck of a lot better. And I like that he does come with the sword, so if you missed that one the first time around, this is the exact same sword, except now it's blue. So it does look good. It's got the same exact wash. It's got the colors of the spawn logo, the green eyes, all that kind of stuff. So it's definitely a pickup if you need the sword in that sense. And really, as I've talked about before, I mean, you do get the Mortal Kombat stand, but the weapons aside and the repaint, the colors aside, I would love to see more accessories or just even a different head sculpt. You know what I mean? If you are going for the more Lord Covenant sort of head, I mean, it's not the spawn look at all for him, being that he's like in a medieval body armor kind of thing. I do like the colors on this. I really like, it's very muted. He's got gold spikes, he's got gold chains, he's got the same exact articulation. But he just looks like a forlorn sort of spawn. And I really do like the way they did the cape colors. It just looks like the absence of color altogether. It's not just white. It's explosion took the color, took the life out of his cape. You can use the Kickstarter spawn weapons with this guy if you'd like. I like the Necroplasm Blast. And yes, there will be another Mortal Kombat 11 character spawn coming soon. So look forward to that. This one, I was trying to think about it. I'm like, what does this remind me of? And I think I settled upon the Wings of Redemption spawn. I think the wings and the cape really do kind of lend itself to one another. So in that sense, it's cool. He does pair up well, just like all the other MK11 spawns with old McFarlane toys. And here he is with the new deluxe Mandarin spawn, which I have a video up if you want to check that out or even the Apostle or Marvel Legends Angela, right? From when she switched companies. And to give you the full look, even though there are three red spawns, we now have the nude spawn. We got the yellow spawn and we got the blue Lord Covenant spawn. All the same bodies, all the same type of figure, same articulation. Three weapons between all these different figures, sword, mace, or axe, different colors here and there. But at the same time, it kind of does look like a video game selection screen. You know what I mean? So this is not something you absolutely have to have. If you're a spawn maniac, sure, why not? But if you're not a big fan of repaints and all that kind of stuff, I would say, yeah, it's a definite pass. Because if you already have the red one, you're good. Mace, sword, axe, doesn't matter. If you get the yellow one, it's cool, I don't have a yellow spawn, and I don't have this blue spawn. So, it looks good in a collection of a lot of spawns, but you don't absolutely need one. And, just to show you, yeah, there's, there's quite a few spawns 
so far. So that's really going to wrap it up for my look at the brand new McFarlane Toys MK11 Lord Covenant Blueberry Spawn or whatever you want to call it, right? <laughs> It's the MK11 Spawn skin. So thank you to McFarland Toys for sending this out to give you guys this fresh look. Look for it on store shelves. Coming soon. Pre-orders are up. I'll have a link in the description below if you want to go ahead and grab him. I'm curious to know what you guys think. Do you want to see more colors of this? I do and I don't. I just want new figures, new skins with all the different upgrades and everything. And I want new accessories. That's really where I'm at with this. But I'm going to leave you guys with that. As always, drink some great coffee, eat some great food. But most importantly, remember, have a fantastic holiday weekend. Live it up. Have a great time. Spend some time with your family. And if there is time at the end of the day, after all of it, go look at some toys. And when you do, let me know what you found. I'll talk to you guys soon. Adios.